my gosh, I've been so naughty. I've been so naughty. I couldn't help it, okay? It was an offer. I couldn't say no. Don't judge me. Hey, YouTube kittens. Greetings from sunny Tokyo. This is Cat Cat. And today, I must confess, I hold a lot. A lot, a lot. I hold a lot of cute Lolita fashion items from Devil Inspired. If you don't know Devil Inspired, I've worked with them before, but this time, the entire haul I bought because I'm their customer just as well. I love their stuff. Ugh! This parcel doesn't even describe how much there's in it. They must have really squished it in there. I'm so excited to find out. So let's open it. Also at the end of the video, there's gonna be three tips of when you wanna order with Devil Inspired and that will make you definitely a lot happier if you wanna order with them. So stay on till the end. Let's unpack, this is so heavy. Let's unpack this heavy, heavy bag. Yes, baby, yes! Whoa. Ah! Oh my god. Oh no. Oh yes. Oh no, oh no. Oh my. Oh gosh. Ah! Da -da 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 -da. It's an apron, a little lacy see through apron. And the reason why I really wanted to have this apron is because there's a lot of Lolita fashion dresses that can really, really get spiced up if you have just a cute apron with it. And since I already have a lot of dresses, sometimes just wearing the same dress again with a cute apron can make all the change. I mean, like already. Look at this. This is already a completely different feel. Woo! Shocking! Cute bows that are detachable in case your dress doesn't have any blue on it. Trump cards here. And guess what? It's a mini pocket. Oh, yes, it is. It's a mini pocket. And then this cute lace going all the way around right till the end. They didn't have to, but they did. Even if you can't afford a lot of Lolita fashion dresses, just having a nice apron can be your lifesaver. I've been wanting this one for such a long time. I've seen a lot of Lolitas have this, and it is a great addition to any Lolita fashion wardrobe. Da 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 da. Ooh! Help me! <laughs> Drowning in petticoats. So this one here is not just a hoop skirt petticoat, is so much more. This one here is definitely the star among the petticoats. Because, look at this. First of all, this petticoat all over has moons and stars, but what makes this so special is at the bottom, it has here these ones, like a brocade that comes down that have stars. So when you're walking, they will be dangling and moving the whole time. And look at the volume you're getting from this. Oh my gosh, this is probably the most volumey petticoat I have in my collection now. This is awesome. This petticoat is also great for you if you are too tall for certain dresses. Make the petticoat maybe a little bit smaller depending on how it is, but if you are too tall for some dresses, you can extend the length of your dress with a petticoat like this. So it will still look like it belongs to the dress above, but it's actually a petticoat underneath that you're showing. This is a must. And the top lace is so soft and it's so sparkly. Oh man, I wanted this one for so long. I'm so glad I bought this one. Oh, it's a dream. I mean, like you could totally just wear it as it is because it is like decorated and stuff. You can totally show this one off. Show it off, flaunt it, baby. Flaunty, flaunty, flaunty. When I was actually ordering with them at the time, they did a special promotion and they gave you a free petticoat with it. Fluff, fluff, fluff. Oh, that's not bad. I think that one in a combination would be good. I need petties. I always need petties because sooner or later, every petty gets a little bit flat, if you know what I mean, apart from the wired ones. I'll take the extra white pity. Thank you so much. Cool offer. So a cute ache print to accessories, any dress that you have. A hoop petty that will definitely be worn under a lot of my dresses and a hoop petty that also can be worn as part of the accessories. You can actually show this one. I mean, this is too pretty to just hide it. A free petticoat, free, free. It doesn't get cheaper than free. And now, for this dress here. I saw this one and I was really, really contemplating whether I should get this in pink or in black. And I think I kept changing my mind the whole time. It took me a while to find this one. Ooh, it comes with a cute card. Da, 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 da. Da, da. One, two. Oh, it's so cute. It's not as uh, JSK. This one here is a saddle pet. It's a Halloween themed one and you can see there's a little Halloween party down here on the dress and there's a couple of points that I found so unique with this one that I needed to have it. I got this one here in an S size and as you can see, saddle pets are generally quite wide and there's a zip, 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 zip to help us get into this saddle pet and it has straps here and you can change 
how long the straps are. It says honey here on the dress and it has little ears. Look at that, the dress has ears. We have the tag and then we go down, we have big buttons and a little bit of ruffles. We're ruffling it up, ruffle, ruffle. And then the print is so cute. First of all, the thing that actually I admire the most is down here is the scalloping. Can you see that? It comes not down in a straight line, it comes down in little shloop shloops, like, like frilly clouds. And I must say, that really, really took my heart. I don't have a single dress that has scalloping. Always the dresses that have scalloping sell out really quickly because it's obviously harder to make than just a straight end. Also, the print repeat is not too common. Look at this, we have like witches, we have bears, zombies. It's so much happening on this dress. And then you can see, here's the pumpkin Halloween party with the pumpkin baby, more pumpkins. We have some zombies and skeletons. I know this is not seasonal, but how spoopy cute is this? Salopets are usually a little bit shorter, so this is also good for the warmer days for me. They're a little bit more breezy and you can wear them with less layers and stuff. Also, it comes with a cute little bow here like this and you can still tie this one that's rare salopets are usually just wide on the side and sometimes like you can even like see into my salopet if they're too wide with this one here you can actually make it tighter and the ends of the belt are hard i heart this so much next dress here that one i saw and it brought a grand big smile on my face when i saw it so i needed it this one here is from alice girl first of all we have a little pin with a heart it has a crown in it, which might give you a little indication what the theme is. Dun, 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 It's a British themed apron skirt. I saw it and I loved it and I needed it and I got it. Ba bam! It is very much longer than the average dresses that I usually own. You can see it's a very, very long skirt, but it has bears and it has, it has, it has so many British motifs all over it that I just could not say no. And the cool thing is because it's an apron skirt, so you have the apron part here, there are little buttons. I can take this off. I can just wear this as a skirt. And since the, of the nature it is, I might get away with wearing this in a bit more formal event, right? Just like a formal blouse. I I'm telling this to myself, so don't stop me. Zip to go into this one, always highly appreciated. Shearing on the back. Starting right at the top, you can see this one here is the front of the apron skirt and we can already see, look at it, these little bears, they're standing guard at Buckingham Palace. All of this can be taken off. You can see here's the button in case you just wanna have the skirt. It looks like this on the top. Here you can see we have, yes, the double decker buses. Dun, 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 the big band. We have telephone booths, we have bears. We have lots of cups of afternoon tea. All the things I love about the UK. Oh my gosh, I love this dress so much. And we have a little Sherlock Holmes bear. Oh my gosh, this the after steam island. This is gonna look so good. And you can see here on the sides, we have the crown, we have the telephone booth, we have one of the cabs, and then we have an umbrella for the rain, because you know, it rains a lot. This is so cute. I know it just makes me so happy. But yeah, this is making me think so many happy things is bringing in a lot of lovely memories. And it says here, God save the queen, send her victorious, happy and glorious, long to reign over us. Now my dream for 2022 would be to wear this one in the UK. I hope that dream comes true. That'd be so amazing. Just wear this in the UK. That dress is so cute. How cute is that? It's so cute. Just take me to the UK, please. Uh, you know what I find really funny is I sing God Save the Queen before I unbox this dress and then the lyrics to God Save the Queen are on the dress. It doesn't get more British than that. Usually when Devil Inspired has like a sale on or some kind of campaign, I usually check the dresses, see what's new, what I do like. And if there's one dress that says, you need me, then I get it. And this is the dress that said, Kathy, you need me. First of all, the accessories came separately with the dress, this accessory here. It comes with a really, really cute apron and I wanted to make sure I have this apron. So I bought the apron because the apron is adorable. Look at these. Next thing. So this brand here is called CC Cat and here is the dress. It is sweet, is it's minty. It has a whole house on it and it's so, so colorful. I saw it, I wanted it, I got it in the end. It says CC Cat all over the print. How perfect is that? It's like Kathy Cat. Yay! So first of all, what I found really cool is there's three bows here at the front. You can't take them off, but 
they just really add to the whole details there's some lacing here there is some lacing there there's some see-through lace there's a bow right here and then we have heart buttons a lot of little heart buttons going around and more and then again a big bow to close the front panel off so much detail right at the front very bright and summery material love it also straps here have two different types of lace are on top of this in the back there's shearing like this is a lot of shearing look at this this really does stretch a lot of shearing look at that look at that and then we have the normal straps here again they also end in some extra lacing but the print was so cute and so so sweet first it starts off with windows here on the top a couple of animals and creatures and then we're already hit main town because this is like a dollhouse just for teddies the idea of teddy dollhouses has been done a couple of times by other brands too but i found just the way they did this with the pastels and the colors it really worked for me it's very pop and very neon but so fun i guess the coloring reminded me a little bit of like children's toys you know the really overly colorful dollhouses that's what this one reminded me of and then with the apron we can make this complete now this one didn't come with a headpiece or similar things like that i think the headpieces i wasn't so excited about so I got it without the head pieces in the end. And once the apron is attached, it's a whole new feel again, isn't it? Perfect. It needed the apron. It couldn't be without the apron. Never separate them. On that note, I really want to see how these dresses will look worn. I'm super excited. Oh my gosh, it's going to be so good. This is like three dresses I really wanted. So let's make it happen. Transformation time. <laughs> And there we go. This one here is called Dessert Party. And the brand is called Cat Can Lolita. Because Cat Can Lolita. This dress is everything I wanted it to have. And I must say, even though the bow and this one is actually supposed to go on the back, I found it so cute. I kind of put it at the front. Of course, you can have it at the back. And then we have the bow right here. And it's just, look at this. Look at this. It adorbs. It adorbs. And especially this part here. The cello pet makes me so happy, happy, happy. Yes, dance party. It is shorter though, so it is more like a salad head than a JFK, but this is gonna be, even though it has a Halloween theme on it, probably one of my summer dresses, I think. <laughs> Dress number two here is called Travel to London. Shout out to all my UK peeps. This dress here, full on UK feels. This is actually the M size. It's the only one of those dresses that I got an M. The other ones I got an S. Look at this. It's longer and it has the stars and it's like, oh, the floof and the poof. The floof and the poof. Whee! Brand name is Alice Girl and the title is Travel to London. And I think this one here, it will definitely be a nice just a long skirt if you want it to wear it as a just long skirt. Or like here, I have the top uh, on and, and then that's how we can enjoy it. <laughs> and the petticoat. I love how much volume I'm getting from this petticoat already. I'm like, who, who, who you, who you, who you, who you. I'm enjoying this. <laughs> Yep, and the final dress here is Rainbow Dollhouse. Da 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 da. And I think the, the, the title of the dress really, really much as the title of the dress is. What really surprised me, and I'm allowed to show you because I'm wearing a petticoat underneath this, it has a skirt and then it has like two types of lace, then it has a really good underskirt with like two layers here of extra lace for the for extra power, and then it has one more underskirt. That's pretty good. Also with the straps, the straps were too long for me. There is a way to actually extend or shorten the straps. So that's really helpful. There's no zip to get into this dress though. So yeah, but there's lots of shearing. So I managed to get in. Pastel, pastel, floof, floof, floof. Pastel, pastel, floof, floof, floof. It's a real dream. Oh man, it's so, it's so pastely. It's so fun. This one is so fun. All of the sizes I used were the S size apart from the going to London. Makes the going to London a super long dress, but actually, to be honest, I think I could have also had an S, but M just works fine with me as well. I am super, super happy with this outcome here. All of these wonderful dresses are now gonna get a little wash and a steam iron, and then they're ready to go. So yeah, that was my haul from Devil Inspired. This haul was not sponsored by them. If you want to order with Devil Inspired, I have a code as well. You get 20% off. It's the code KathyCat. Be sure to use the code so you get a little bit off, but also I have three advices for you. One is if you have a question about the dress that is not answered in the details down below, then be sure to actually message them. Sometimes what I've done before is I thought an item was not included, so I bought it separately, but it turns out it was included, so I had it twice. 
or I thought an item was included and it wasn't included. So for example, this dress here would be completely different without the apron and the apron is sold separately and I wanted it, so I bought it separately. Number two is shipping. If you get a cheap dress from Devil Inspired, always first check on their shipping thing. Sometimes they have free shipping over $100, sometimes they have free shipping internationally. That's the time when you really want to strike. That's when I go and buy because shipping can really, really change the price of your dress. And you don't want to get a cheap dress and then end up with loads of shipping. No! Sign up for their newsletter. That's what I'm doing. Whenever I'm seeing there is some kind of special sale on or the shipping is off, that's when I kind of browse because it really, really helps. It helps. It helps so much. And number three, to avoid disappointment, always check of the preparation time. These dresses I ordered here, I ordered last year. Yeah, so I was cool with waiting, but the reason is sometimes dresses will take three to four months preparation time and sometimes dresses will take three to four weeks. So don't forget that those brands send it to Devil Inspired and then they send it out to you. Please make sure when you order with them that you always check that under each dress it's written. And especially if it's a dress, for example, that's on pre-order, it's the pre-order time then plus the preparation time and you don't want to like buy a dress and be looking forward to having it and it doesn't come for a couple of months. I was cool waiting. These ones are perfect in time for summer. So I'm good. Some of these dresses are actually already sold out, but some are still available. So I put links down below. Be sure to use my code KathyCat and let them know that you found me through KathyCat. Thanks so much for tuning in. Thank you for all the support. And don't forget, I stream every week on Twitch several times. So be sure to come over and hang out with me. It's been a tough couple of months since last year. So don't forget, let's be sweet to each other and do what you love and love what you do. Bye. Thank you so much. I was supposed to be in the UK last year. I was supposed to be the in the UK in the UK this year. So I'm taking this dress as a little, you know, reimbursement for not being able to travel right now. We have a hoop skirt that is definitely a must have for the second. I'm still wearing my glasses. Nah!